in conjunction with Hawaii Natural en Energy Institute, uh, University of Hawaii at Manoa presents the RGEMS project with myself, Charles White, Kyle Levesky, Ikaika Mokil, Christian Kill Commons, and our faculty advisor, Kevin Davis. RGEM stands for Advanced Real-Time Grid Energy Monitor System. In order to help achieve Hawaii's aggressive renewable portfolio standard targets, high amounts of variable renewable energy must be integrated into the grid. The transient nature of renewable energy requires careful monitoring of the electric grid. However, current methods of distribution level grid monitoring are large and costly. Our project aims to implement a flexible, high resolution, low cost metering solution to help the utility implement smart grid technologies and increase the penetration of renewable energy. The device measures voltage, current, and power at the distribution level of the electrical grid. The architecture consists of a mesh network with remote meters which pass data to gateways for collection. This reduces cost because previously every device required its own cellular data plan. Remote devices consist of a microcontroller which interfaces to a power monitor integrated circuit, a QPS and LCD. The microcontroller sends data to a central gateway device via a wireless RF module the gateway device hosts a single board computer that streams data to a server. The server provides a database with web interface for data analytics. These are the, the results we obtained for RMS current, voltage, and frequency. A benchmark was created between our unit and a commercial power monitor called the PQ. Our results for frequency and RMS voltage were similar between units about 0.05% and 0.25% respectively, but there was a 40% difference in RMS current, which is, further, which is being further investigated. This data comes from default scaling based on the power monitor manual. Calibration is expected to improve accuracy. This semester we demonstrated that a 16-bit microcontroller is capable of performing the tasks required of a power monitoring device. A 10-tap bandpass FIR filter can be designed to locate the fundamental line frequency. A bootloader application requires careful manipulation of flash memory, making easy bootloader an attractive solution. XB Digimesh can aggregate measurements from multiple remote devices and lower the data costs. This work has contributed to the development of a low-cost power monitor. 